Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you how to install Oracle database on your Windows operating system. So let's start. At first, go to your favorite browser and type Oracle download, okay? Uh, Oracle download for Windows. Then click on the first link. Then scroll down below. And as you can see, this is the 19C, but I want the 21C. So Oracle Database 21C for Microsoft Windows X64, I will click on this zip. And as I click on this zip, it is asking us to click on this box. So I will click this button and then I will click on download button. As I click on download button, it is telling me to sign in. But if you don't have an account, then you can click on create account and you have to fill up this registration form which is uh, given here as you can see you have to give your email address password uh, country job title if you don't have a job you can give student here in place of job title and then you can fill up the form and click on create account it will send an email to your uh, email which you have given here and you have to verify it uh, like that you can create an account but i already had an account so i will just give my email id and password and i will click on sign in As you can see it started downloading the zip file so I will wait till it uh, finishes to download as you can see the download is completed so I will go to the download section and here you can see the zip file is downloaded so what you have to do is just right click and click on extract to Windows 64 to 13000 DB home so as you click it will start extracting so I will cancel this extraction because I already have a downloaded uh, folder previously. So I will just delete it and I will use the previous downloaded folder. So as you can see, this is the folder which I downloaded previously. I will double click on it and I will click on this setup.exe file. You have to click on yes to give it permission. Then as you can see, it is preparing to install. Click on next, accept the terms, then click on next. As you can see, it will install Oracle Database 21C Express Edition to this folder inside C drive. It will create an app folder inside it. There will be a registry that is my names folder and then under products folder under 21C folder, it will download the packages and libraries of Oracle Database 21C. Click on next. And here you have to give the password which you want to give as default for the Oracle database. So I will give system as password SYSTEM and SYSTEM. You can give any password of your choice. Then click on next. Click on install. It started installing. So this is showing the status. You have to wait for some time. So as you can see, the installation is completed and it is showing us Oracle database installed successfully. So you have to click on this finish button. After that, go to the start menu and scroll down below to see if the Oracle is installed properly or not. As you can see, Oracle Ora DB2 Home 1 is installed here and under this we have the SQL Plus. So you have to click on this SQL Plus. This is the Oracle CLI. So in this SQL plus, we can create our own table, our own database. So at first we have to enter the username. So I will enter system as my username. And then remember the password you have set uh, while installing this Oracle. So I gave it system. So I am typing system and then enter. As you can see last login successful time was that and connected to this. Uh, so connection is successful now what you can do you can create a new table so create table student inside that I will give the ID and the type of ID will be number 10 then the name will be where care 2 and the size can be 50 and then uh, what can I give age number age number will be maximum size of three three digits can be there and then i will create this table enter as you can see table is created and then i can insert 
into the table into student table as you can see i am inserting the value one comma my name then uh, suppose an age and then i am clicking enter as you can see uh, there is an error while selecting okay so i have given the wrong query i have to type values and then I have to click on enter. As you can see, one row is created. So this is how you can install your Oracle database. You can also check it uh, by going on the C drive. And then you will find a folder as app. And then inside this folder, this folder, 21C is installed and all the packages are installed inside this. So yeah, this is how you install Oracle database on your Windows system. Thanks for watching my video. Have a nice day.